Okay, Itamikoko, good evening or good night. It is about 8.30 in the p.m. on Thursday, October 5th, 2017, in the lunar cycle Awakatsuki, some the deer moon. In fact, I'm looking at the moon right now and it's looking pretty much a full moon this evening. Um, I'm on my way to the north side of town. I have a client over there who called me this morning, um, had, has a, a family of raccoons living under her house, and so I went and set up a couple of traps on the side of her place, and one of them has a raccoon in it. So I'm going to go fetch the raccoon and reset the traps uh, for the evening. Yeah, they're, they're kind of a panda. Oh yeah. So that's a baby, right? Yeah, it's a young one. Oh. Young, but not, um... Not so young that, uh, can't take care of herself. So, all right. So what I'll do is I'll take her down probably to the wetlands and then um, I'll bring the trap back and I'll reset both of them. So you can see the scenario here. So there, the raccoons are living right under the house here. Crawling right through there. And uh, you can see here, it's a little bit of blood on the snow. I don't know if you can make that out in the greens and yellows, but uh, it's a little bit of blood. The raccoon kind of hurt itself in the trap. They hurt its hand or something, or its mouth. Um, so anyway, I set it back up and see if we can uh, catch the rest of the family. Maybe I'll have another raccoon or two here by morning. But um, you know, the big moral of the story here is that uh, anytime there's some space to get under the house, get under a shed. You know, these kind of things you should shore them up. That way you save the animal a lot of drama, you know? Drama and trauma. <laughs> <laughs> 